take it to the limit. This is classic racing and these are classic racers. 1974. Roger DeCosta was already a three-time world champion and heading for a record-breaking five 500cc World Motocross Championships. 1975, the year that future world champion Kenny Roberts took an untried four-cylinder dirt tracker to Indianapolis and surprised the Harley Wrecking Crew only to have the bike banned. 1976, the year that saw David in the form of Steve Baker take on Goliath in the form of Barry Sheen at the Race of the Year at Maori Park in England and not only surprised Barry, but Agostini, Reed, and a host of Europe's best. 1977, preceding one of the most lauded returns to any racetrack, Mike Harewood proved once again at age 37 and after a 10 year retirement that he was still master of the Isle of Man. 1978, Russ Collins, the king of the quarter mile, came within a gnat's hair of becoming the first to top 200 miles an hour in the standing quarter. And two-time American champ, Kenny Roberts, launched his attack on what became three consecutive world championships. Those are the classic times, captured for all generations in Take It to the Limit, the motorcycle odyssey for all time. Winner of two major film festivals and featuring a platinum soundtrack of music by Foreigner, Tangerine Dream, Jean-Luc Ponty and Arlo Guthrie, Take It to the Limit, the classic motorcycle film now making special showing at your motorcycle dealer. <laughs>